<laughs> Still sick. <laughs> I'll see you guys later. It is time to cleanse your mind with the sweet sounds of sand smashing by Tumblr. Every disaster movie starts with everyone ignoring a scientist. Since Asgard is flat, they probably have a round Asgard society that are social outcasts. They say what doesn't kill you makes you stronger, but sometimes what doesn't kill you just leaves you bitter, crippled, and weaker. The second person in a chain is the one who started it. Someone had to voice all the gibberish that is the language in The Sims game. It's a dream job right there. Superman's x-ray vision probably wasn't very helpful until the 80s due to all of the lead paint. Babies are a clean hard drive that can be programmed with any language. I'm gonna stall C++ on mine. When you die 50 years old, everybody says that you are so young. But when you're alive in 50, everyone says that you're old. Being middle class is when spending $100 is expensive, but earning $100 isn't a lot of money. I'm tagged in this post and I don't like it. In real life, arguing with someone is super socially awkward. On the internet, it's practically the default interaction. California is the nearest state to Hawaii, but Hawaii is almost the furthest state from California. And finally, the ultimate sign that some serious shit just went down in a TV show is when the episode ends with no music playing in the credits. I read that capsaicin makes your mouth feel like it's burning because it increases your nerve sensitivity to heat. And menthol works by doing the same thing to cold. So, if I eat habanero pepper and then chew a bunch of breath mitts, they'll probably cancel each other out and I'll be fine. Hey, guess what hellfire tastes like? Fun fact, the nerve endings for ouch too hot and ouch too cold are different, which means they can both be activated at once without canceling out, aka rip OP. Ah, I finally finished the Waluigi board. And remember, after every session, you must say WAH to it. Floor soup's on the menu again tonight, fellas. Ugh, I hate this fucking restaurant. Why do we always eat here? People who go, Call it three! Are stronger than God. You ever wear fingerless gloves and hold a hot drink and immediately feel like a 1900s Victorian urchin taking a break from pit pocketing to gratefully accept a meal from the soup kitchen? How did you know? Introducing White Shell! It's like Blue Shell, but inverted. White Shell, Blue Spikes, and Wings. It hits the person in last place, just to be a dick. I'm sorry, did you mean the American economy? Ugh, <sighs> overdraft underscore fees dot jpeg. I just realized tater tots is short for potato toddlers, and I don't know how to feel about that. Eat the potato babies and be a man! Shorty got them problem mag jeans, boots with the erm. Oh wow, this shop has everything my heart desires. Yes, I will warn you, every item comes with a price. Yes, I know how shops work. The price may be more than you expect to pay. Yes, I know how freaking taxes work too, God. All right, listen, if you don't know the difference between a hare and a rabbit, You've never gazed into the cold, wild eyes of a hare and know that if it could speak, it would speak backwards. Jesus is terrifying. Get that away from me! All right, Americans, name every Canadian province. All right, I can do this. Here we go. Hockey, Quebec, Totoro, Alaska, Syrup, Trebek, Sorry, Degrassi, and Moose. How'd I do? Unique blue-eyed white boy. This is on a cat breeder's website, but I keep laughing at that phrase out of context. Movie producers be like, young adult authors be like, Yukio be like, Sans. Okay, this is possibly bonkers advice, but I found that writing a cover letter is so easy if you just like, briefly inhabit the persona of a high elf who thinks they're hot sh <laughs> and can't imagine why any of their previous work experience would be anything less than gobsmackingly impressive. As you will see in my resume, I have extensive experience with. I am ideal for this position because I've noticed this thing you do well, and here's how I will help do it better. Just really go for it, you know? Just act like you're already half-hired. That is... it's good advice right there. This is not a sponsor, but fuck Disney! Why, why would it be a sponsor? I'm just trying to be clear. Tumblr is so boring with all you nerds at DashCon heart emoji.
Y'all better come back with some amazing tales. Wow. This post is like reading an inscription carved into a bathhouse wall during Pompeii's last days. Except nobody peed in the lava, you know? Why is it that from 12 a.m. to 4 a.m. water enters a state where it's so much better in every way? Because you are tired, your higher brain functions shut down, leaving only your ancient fish brain. It likes the splash. Cam confirm I had two glasses of water one sitting and it was the shit. You have pleased your brain fish. I don't, I don't like the concept of brain fish. Stop it. Okay, this is the handbook each actor who plays Aladdin at Disney World is given. <clears throat> and I quote, Park safety. Although we want every Disney guest to have fun, our number one priority is safety. Because of this, Aladdin will never, under any circumstances, kill a park guest. Unless it is absolutely necessary to save the lives of a greater number of park guests. This is referred to as Aladdin's exception. Sir, we have a person taking hostage in Frontierland. Send in the street. The sensible part of the brain. Dude, you made like enough pasta that you could take it for lunch tomorrow. Just just put it in a container. The overwhelming majority of the brain. Shovel that pasta in your face! Do it! Put it in your face! The future is meaningless, but the pasta is now! Gobble it up like the little skeleton you are! Yeah! It's time to cleanse your mind. The sick boy couldn't make it to the office, so he has to do it from his shotgun mic at home. By tomorrow. 90-year-olds have lived through the Great Depression, Dust Bowls, a World War, the Cold War, the Space Race, the Civil Rights Movement, nine constitutional amendments, and now, Endgame. The most amazing thing about the MCU, apart from the superpowers, is the fact that English is the main language of 99% of the galaxy. We've probably missed out on some really good OC because the OP didn't think it was good enough or was too self-conscious to post it. <sighs> See why. You're not really middle class until you can afford your student loan payments and your drug habit without giving up food. The people who met Stan Lee in normal situations in real life had a Stan Lee cameo. What a MCU wants in this batch. When adopting a mistreated rescue, the pet is a reminder to the owner that not all humans are good, while the owner is a reminder to the pet that not all humans are bad. I like that one. That was sweet. Being able to FaceTime 911 operators would significantly help solve a lot of cases. That's brilliant, actually. A $20 bill feels like an adult dollar. When we start a new game, we look up to highly skilled players and hope to be like them. Once we actually get good, we start to miss the time when all of it was still new to us. That's probably why I'm not a fan of Sword and Shield. It took us 600 years of printing to realize that writing like this conveys mocking in a written form. The phrase, it's all downhill from here, is usually used negatively, but going downhill is usually the easiest part of the trip. Maybe people who stubbornly defend the flat earth theory are space enthusiasts who secretly hope to be taken into space for free and shown the proof of the earth's curvature. Damn. If The Simpsons stays on the air for seven more years, Homer Simpson will actually be as old as he is in the show, and then they'll just make him older to piss us off. There are people on this planet that have no idea that pizza exists. Vote for me, PM Seymour, World President 2024. I'll make sure everybody gets a pizza in whatever nation they live in and definitely not start a lot of horse pineapples on pizza. No, no, I wouldn't do that, ever. Your face is a combination of thousands of years worth of other people's faces. Fudge and bruh. If musicians always sound great when practicing, they're practicing the wrong things. And finally, if an object is large enough, it becomes a location. So congratulations, listener. Your mama's a location. This has been Sick Boy Just Wrecked Your Shears by Tumblr. Hi, I work at a hospital and we've been recently flooded with virgins who keep saying they've been killed? Something about a sweater? Point is, we're asking how to fix, like, 50 nosebleeds and an apparent cute overdose. <laughs> Zian, you want to show this guy the door? Sure thing, boss! Alright, so what's your favorite insult? Mine would have to be, you look like someone who would vest in thigh-high crocs. Pet taught me this. 30 million possible sperm, and you're the one that got through, huh? <laughs> so ah! proud of this one. Wiki, how to be as cute as Sienna, please? 
Step one, look in the mirror. Step two, smile. You've done it. Shave and a haircut. Buddy once told me. Oh, God damn it, Sienna. I feel like you can make anything ominous. Maybe I can. Prove it. Say the most innocent thing in an ominous voice. Be careful out there. Boss, I'm scared. Yeah, me too. Hmm. Was there ever a time you mistaken alcohol as juice and got drunk? Or better yet, have you ever been drunk before? Yes, but I didn't get drunk. Instead, I breathed fire for a while as the alcohol burned in the bioreactor. It was pretty dang cool. He's working on a dragon suit for her right now. See it? Why tease us with the virgin killer? You know, some people are just gonna make you look easy to go for. You know, for a username like that, you think you'd stand by it. Jesus. Semi-hypothetical. If you had to obliterate or take over the human race for whatever reason, would you rather A, do a Judgment Day style, or B, Simulacra-ish style? Nah. Pat has an eviler plan for obliterating the world. Does the eviler plan involve a galactic space cannon? Nope. Better take it, P. All right, first, you convince the nations to form a one-world government. And then you become the leader of that government. And then you pass a bill that all the pizza joints must put pineapples on pizza by world law. And then just watch the world kill each other over pineapple lovers and haters. Boss, couldn't they just like take the, the, the pineapple off the, the pizza? Don't ruin this for me. Has Pete built up a slight immunity to caffeine yet? Oh, he has. Regular death wish coffee does nothing to him. He had to switch to their cold brew. I am the sound man! I am the one who yells! And it works. Alright, what's your opinion on the other robots like Alexa or Siri? Commercial grade Foss AI. What's your favorite holiday? Grimbus! So, like, what's your favorite anime? Chubbits! I'm afraid I haven't heard of that one. Oh, my hip! Oh, no! Do you and P ever shout at each other over dumb things? He bought the Heelys when I told him he shouldn't! I live a fast and free lifestyle! You have no smooth surfaces outside! I had kind of a bad day. You yeah, having good jokes? In February, March? Yeah, but April, May. Boo! Alright, so like, what's the worst part of being P's entire control? Like, the only one preventing him from being done with these stupid-ass Heelys. <sighs> but sometimes I cannot prevent it because... He's out of my line of sight. Zip. God damn it. After such heavy demand and peer pressure, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna show you my soft blue tits. Oh shit! Sian, run the get wrecked initiation. I'm on it! <laughs>